When I think of Alberta, the first thing that comes to mind is nature. The Rocky Mountains, beautiful blue fresh water, all great things, but this weekend we're getting away from nature and into the city. Calgary is one of my favorite cities in Canada. It's got amazing people and food, and this weekend there's a ton of excitement around the Junos, an annual celebration of the very best in Canadian music. Our first stop is Hotel Arts, a beautiful modern boutique hotel downtown. All right, just checked into my hotel, and I got a little gift bag. Located in Hotel Arts is Raw Bar, an Asian fusion restaurant and lounge with an extensive cocktail menu of very Instagrammable drinks and a ton of different food options that are perfect to share. What we're best known for is the steam buns. So if you're dim sum oh fans, God. yeah. Cheers. <laughs> The next day we went out to Bridgeland, a hip neighborhood in Calgary that's home to a mix of condos, houses and local businesses like Shiki Menya, a popular ramen joint with a lineup before the place was even open. Shiki Menya has a very distinct vibe that becomes apparent the moment you step into the restaurant. From the music selection to the decor to the staff uniforms, you can tell that this place is cool. But what about the food? To find out, we ordered three different ramen dishes that were prepared by the owner, Koki, and his team. We got our miso classic, this one's karamiso garlic, and this one is our chili goma. While ramen may be the main attraction, Shiki Menya serves up some amazing other items like these tacos. Because Shiki Menya makes their noodles in-house and their soups from scratch using local ingredients, they serve a limited quantity of bowls every day. Today the magic number is 150, and once that last bowl is served, the place closes up. So if you want a seat here, you better get there early and follow the restaurant on social media. I can definitely see why this place is so popular. So we're at the Toolshed Brewing Company. This is the biggest tool shed I've ever seen. <laughs> Toolshed is leading the way when it comes to craft beer in Calgary, and it was really cool to get a tour by one of its founders, Graham, a very passionate and animated entrepreneur. Oh, they're shooting out. You're gonna see how fresh beer is right out of the tank. It'll blow your skull apart how good and fresh and beautiful beer is out of that bright tank. And now I just gotta get that beer from that tank to your face in the best quality possible, right? And it's not going on with my head and my face right now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. As we discovered, I'm not too good at the tasks required to make beer. Oh, this is heavy. Holy sh Oh my god. How strong are you? That was like two small children. But drinking it is a different story. Noon, it's noon! <laughs> we had a great chat about taking risks and following your passions. I was really inspired by Graham's story. Not only was he able to build a hugely successful business, but he's supporting other brewers along the way. This seems to reflect the entrepreneur community in Calgary. If you've got a great idea, this is the place to make it happen. Although it was still under construction when I visited, no doubt one of the most exciting things to come to Calgary this year is Studio Bell, home of the National Music Center. Here you'll find exhibition and performance space, art installations, studios, and even an artist residence program. This will be the destination to learn about and celebrate Canadian music, and I'm really excited to visit again once it's open. We capped off the day at Shokunin, a Japanese izakaya-style restaurant. I won't hesitate to say that this was one of the best dining experiences I've ever had, which has nothing to do with the fact that they kept bringing us food. I'm so goofy. We're just getting a lot of things on this table, and it's great. Cheers. This is so good. It's stupid. Having chatted with chef and owner Darren McLean, what impressed me most about Shokunin was its mission statement, to be sustainable, accessible, and impressively local, from the ingredients right down to the plates on which our food was served. If eating is a social experience for you, this is a place to check out. It has a very similar logo. It's got a logo. It's a match made in heaven. It was meant to be. It was meant to be. Juno Fest is an opportunity to check out Canadian music acts performing at different venues across the city. And Calgary has some pretty cool venues for live music.
next day, we went to the Simmons Building, home to a few local businesses like Sidewalk Citizen Bakery, who produce a wide range of baked goods, pastries, and desserts, fusing tradition with innovation. One of their most unique items and one you have to try is the charred avocado spread. I thought it was going to be a spread, but they actually just have an avocado, charred it. It's amazing, and it has this sourdough bread. Gotta wait, though. Gotta take all our pictures. There's a science behind this. Throw a little filter on that. Oh my god. Let's spread that on there. Mmm. I feel very loved here. Yeah. <laughs> you, need a, you need a hand? Gotta... Do you actually want to read this to me? Can we like act this out as if it were what like, am a one-act play? It's just a, it's from a the poem. poem on the... like, I don't know. On your napkin. How, how are we trying to say it here? We'll just pretend you're, you, you wrote it. You came and I was longing for you. You cooled a heart that was burning with desire. How's that? That's beautiful. Didn't you feel something I there? Wanted, could you continue? Could you just like, improvise or something? <laughs> so after all the amazing food we had in Calgary, one of our last meals is going to be something that I'm more accustomed to. It is a tad dry. Into the ham. I'm the Swiss. Did you eat like Love both sandwiches at once? There were two sandwiches? <laughs> so it appears that there were actually two sandwiches that I decided to consume at one time. Because I'm very efficient, and uh, sometimes you just gotta eat two sandwiches at once. You're presenting an award today. I am. What'd you do to prepare for this? Absolutely nothing. I don't even know what award I'm presenting. You know what, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna say you won. You're gonna be in the audience, right? I appreciate it. Come up. Good. Both get tackled off stage. Canadians are so modest and polite. We need to bring some drama to this show, right? Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Let's get let's get viral tonight, right? That's my new song. Let's get viral. I love it. Who are you excited to see tonight? Uh, you. Okay. Did that, you can take that off your list. That's it. That's it. Just Rain may have been excited to see me again, but there was only one comedian that I wanted to reunite with. Nicole, come on in. Come hang out. Yeah. How's it going? Nicole? I had an amazing time in Calgary, and every time I come back, I learn more about what a great city it is for people, food, entrepreneurs, and music. I can't wait to come back.